So, this, boys and girls, underneath all of the wrapping, is one Lycoming 0320. Perfect for the Frankenstein. It's um, had a good life. She ain't new. And she's had many an abusive owner. But it's mine. It's gonna be perfect. So, now we gotta start thinking about fitting that too. Once again, Dad, you're a dead set legend for coming up with this one. Coming across it. Absolutely perfect. Oh yeah, that's what I needed. Woohoo! One engine there for my aeroplane. <laughs> Good tape, hey. <laughs> yeah, I, when I wrap something, honey, I do a good job. Oh, really? Ta -da. Yay! So far, I need Merry Christmas! Yay! Firewall forward is going to be a bit of a challenge because I don't think it's going to fit in the shed anymore. So what do we do? There's my engine and there's a propeller with the landing gear and stuff everywhere. So how are we going to do that? I've been thinking about this for a little while. The theory I have is well this is this is the my actual engine uh my firewall so that's why it's not actually riveted onto the front of the aeroplane is because i want to use it as a template to make a stand up and build like a firewall forward package in this area here so there's the bottom of this stand there's my engine so in amongst all of that i'm going to build the engine firewall forward package Hmm, that's the theory, see how we go. So I've marked out all of the cross braces and rivet holes and all of that sort of stuff. And this is where the engine mount has been built off as well. So um, yeah, just put it all together now and see how we go. Okay, so that's my little drawing of the firewall that I've actually got and the forward part of the um, fuselage. So now when I mount the engine mount there in the engine, I can plumb it, hopefully, all the, all the plumbing and wiring and all of that. Um, so it, does, it misses all of the bits. Hmm, that's the theory anyway, so we'll see how we go. Now I just gotta fit that to that, and then we can do things. Here we are out at Sire's place. I've got my engine mount here. Do you remember a while back I did my um, landing gear and I talked about my little mate Sai who was five foot 21? How many of you got that? Because um, that's five foot 21. <laughs> so yes, engine mount. There's our engine. And there's my dummy firewall. So we've just taken some weights there. So we can work out exactly how far forward off the firewall that we're going to make it. And then um, into the next thing. Yes. So I has some cool toys in here for us. Yes, he can weld way better than I can. All right. We may be rough, but at least we're expensive. <laughs> just getting the engine level. So just trying to put out Wait, so we just filled a bucket of water and threw a few bolts in until we've got... Sweet as a nut. There you go. Now we just got to work it out from there. For those who are wondering, this is on the centre line, so they won't count. Just adds to the to the weight of the whole, the whole engine, not, not the pivot. Yeah, good stuff. Okay. All right. This is the setup. We've had to modify the frame just to give it a bit of room there like that. So our crane can slide on in. 
there's our ballast to get um, level and we had to throw a little bit of ballast on that side there just to get the get it level that way as well and now now we can nut out where we need to change all of this mount part here to fit this point so that's what we're up to now well we're committed now thousand dollar engine mount <laughs> it'll be fine well if that's not for frankenstein what is even the stand we've um frankenstein frankenstein the snot out of that too <laughs> oh look at that huh yes it's just tacked in we've got to do gussets and all of the all of the final welding and everything but that's what she's gonna look like <laughs> sorry <laughs> what have you done <laughs> Hey. That was a good idea at the time. <laughs> <laughs> now we got to grind up. <laughs> ah, love it. Look at that, eh? And to think, we didn't draw and, and plan anything. There's no trigonometry in that, so I'm glad I didn't take it at school. <laughs> nothing to do with a uh, triangle. I suppose we shouldn't have. I suppose it would look different if it was on CAD. But hey, she's going to work a treat. It's built. Yeah, it is. system, engine cowling, I'm really looking forward to the engine cowling. That'll be, watch this space for that one. Uh, and um, basically it's a firewall, pa firewall forward package. I can transfer all of the details from the firewall here into the fuselage. Hopefully that works because, I don't know, we'll, we'll, we'll make it up. Um, yeah, a very big thank you to Gwen at um, Premier Aero Parts at Bundy. Um, I got the propeller, the exhaust, and the engine mount from, from her. And uh, so, you're a legend. Thank you so much for your help. Really appreciate it. Um, so yeah, watch this space. <laughs>